there you two. Now we're moving on to our next steps for our sun painting. So to do the last, in the last video, we got to this stage where we've got the sun background. We've got our foil sun face. And what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to glue the sun into position in the centre of the painted sun, just like that. And then I'm going to add some pattern around the edge, not very much, so I'm going to do a circle around. You decide on your own patterns and then I'm going to add spiral shapes going around the edge. Okay, but it's up to you to decide on the pattern that you want to add to your sun. Okay, now I'm not going to finish off doing my spiral shapes because what I want to focus on in this video is making the prints and if you have a look these are all printed now when we say a print a print is when you copy the something you make a copy of the surface of something so today what we're going to do to print is we're going to use a piece of cardboard and a piece of string and we're going to glue the string onto the cardboard and then dip it into paint and then print the pattern onto the painting okay so let me show you what I mean so I'm going to take my piece of cardboard just a small piece if you look how big it is I just use part of a cardboard box and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put glue all over that piece of cardboard and then I'm going to take my string and I'm going to make it into a small circle and stick that down in the middle. Okay, let me move that big bit of glue. So stick it down in the middle and then I'm going to start to circle the string around. It takes a, just a little while to get it to stick down properly. And as I circle around the string, you can see it makes a spiral shape. Okay, and what I'm going to do is once that has dried, I'm going to paint that, put paint all over the top, and then I'm going to press down onto the sun shape to make a print. Okay, I'm just going to leave it to dry, let the glue dry and to make sure it won't move, just for a few minutes, a few seconds. And then once it's dry, I can start to paint. Okay, I'm going to move on a bit more quickly than I would like, but here I go. So I take my spiral shape, dip my brush into the paint, and I'm just going to paint over that spiral shape. And I'm going to copy the spiral shape onto my painting. So remember a print, is when we make a copy of something. Okay, so painted all of that spiral shape, move my paint out of the way, and now I can take my spiral shape, turn it over, and press down nice and hard, and lift up, and it's made that print. Over here, yeah, I might need to add just a little bit more paint onto my cardboard. And let me do one in the corner over here. One in the corner over here. 
and then I'm going to change it. I'm not going to use do another spiral shape. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the side of the cardboard to make a different type of print. So I'm going to paint on the side of the cardboard and then make a side print. And can you see that the shape of the cardboard inside has come out on the painting? So I'm going to do one each side there. And you might try dipping the cardboard into the paint. Sometimes though that makes the paint too thick so you might need to get rid of a little bit of the paint. Okay and I think now I might do a zigzag shape so I'm going to keep using my cardboard or a triangle shape just like that in the middle. You can choose whatever shapes you would like to put to print. Okay, and so I've used cardboard to make a string block print and I've used a block print on the side there as well. Okay, so that's one type of printing you've learnt to, to do. And remember it's called block printing. Okay, and that is your sun painting finished. So well done year two. Um, I can't wait to see your work on the dojo. Um, have a lovely day, rest of the day, and I will see you soon. Bye bye.